capture and replace. You would never guess what could be done with these tools. In order to do that, let's take a deep dive into them and try to understand what can they actually do and how to utilize them. Start by creating a panel and add a quad sphere. Increase the details and rebuild. Select surface, hold filter smooth and drag your pencil. Add symmetry. Go to layer, add fill color layer and change the color to orange. Add another fill color layer, tap on it, invert mask and make sure the primary color is white. Now use the paintbrush to draw eyes and mouth. Enable snapping by going to override and select snapping. To duplicate an object in uniform, select scene, duplicate and drag your pencil. Now if you try to change the fill color of one of the objects, the other one will change too. To unlink the two objects, go to scene, select replace and drag your pencil on one of the objects. Now you can edit each one individually. But this is only one of the things the replace tool can do. For the second example, we need a new scene. So create a new panel and add a high poly cube. Now go back to the scenes where the two spheres and in the tools grid, select scene capture and drag your pencil on one of the spheres. Now select scene, replace, and before we proceed, if you select override, you will notice that when we use the capture tool, it adds ID storage object provider to the override list. Let's leave it for now, and go to the scene where the cube is, and drag your pencil on the cube. The cube is replaced with the captured sphere. If you thought about a good use of this feature, Please write it on the comment section below. Now try to change the color of the new object. Again, both objects are changing color. If this is not the result that you want, and you prefer unlinking the objects, we have to use the replace tool again. But before that, go to override and delete the IT storage object provider. Now you can edit each object individually. One more last thing. Capture the red sphere and go back to the first scene. And this time use the duplicate tool and see what's happening. By now I'm sure you know exactly how to fix it.